Welcome back to my daily report market analysis videos with me, Richard Perry, market analyst at Handtech on Wednesday, 11th of March. Looking at dollar yen, a um, lot of volatility through dollar yen, huge moves swinging both lower and then back higher yesterday. We've seen the swing back lower today. It seems as though the treasury yields are a big factor behind how dollar yen moves, and I think that's going to continue to be the case. Treasury yields moving back lower, a little bit edging off their lows of the day. Subsequently, we've seen dollar yen edging higher off the lows of the earlier session, 104.10 being that reaction low now, 104.90, so 80 pips already off the lows, um, but still trading lower on the day at the moment. Um, now, in terms of uh, how we're viewing dolly at the moment, this reaction higher, I mean, considering how large that candle was yesterday, you cannot get away from the fact that there could well be now some sort of um, reasonable suggestion that a recovery is in place um, or in motion. Um, got through 38.2% fib of the big sell-off, and that, when I say big sell-off, it was a massive sell-off. Um, over a thousand pips of sell-off through dollar yen uh, in space of what three weeks or so. Subsequently, uh, back 38.2% fib of that through 105.40. Um, so you'd say that that's still going to be a, a fairly important gauge, as is I think the uh, old lows of 104.45 to 105 figure area, um, which had also interestingly sort of played out as a bit of a turning point. But uh, back through that now. Um, and uh, trading around about the 105 figure mark, so just settling in the sort of in the um, early morning trading period in, in the last uh, few hours, back above that um, 104.20, uh, sorry, 104.45 mark. So I think how the market responds to this resistance um, around 105 figure area, 105.90, will be important now because obviously we've had a few highs in this area in the last few days and um, obviously that is uh, an area where the market is sort of struggling now. So uh, can the market get back through so uh, that 106 area and back um, towards the 106.50, 107.60 area would be the question because uh, that is clearly the resistance in place at the moment. Um, in terms of turnaround on the momentum indicators that there is this uptick on the stochastics and RSI back through 30 so theoretically that's sort of not a million miles off buy signal territory but is it are there given the volatility that we're seeing at the moment is this um, a move that you can really trust well I think obviously that uh, higher low support at 104.10 now needs to hold in place for this recovery to maintain uh, any sort of semblance of momentum and uh, continue higher. So, yeah, we're still seeing the prospect of a recovery on dollar yen, but still very choppy. So, I wish you good luck in your trading today. Click here to subscribe to our analysis videos and go to our website to sign up for our webinars.